got to do is to get on your knees, people. Get on your knees, I'm begging you, please. Get on your knees, I'm begging you, please. If you're going to hang out with me for the next couple of minutes, I would like for you to share this video, share this video on your page, share it on a friend's page, share it in a room, share it in a group, and when you share this video, tag someone in it. Our scripture reading is coming to you today from John 8, 44, John chapter 8, verse 44. And I'd like for you to grab your Bible, grab your notepad, and grab your pen, because I expect you to take notes. Our topic for today is, like father, like son, the apple don't fall too far from the tree. Let us read John 8, 44. You are of your father, the devil. The desire of your father you want to do. He was a murderer from the beginning and does not stand in the truth because there is no truth in him. When he speaks a lie, he speaks it from his own resources for he is a liar and the father of it. Mosai, I ask, that you will send your Holy Spirit with my words. Let your Holy Spirit lend clarity where I would have lent confusion. In the house's name I say, let it be done. Be like father, like son, the apple don't fall too far from the tree. If you go to Egypt and you are visiting one of the Egyptian historical sites, you are going to see a strange phenomenon. What is this phenomenon? You're going to see a lot of statues, figurines of man, very gigantic statues without noses. When the inquiry went up as to why so many of these statues do not have any noses, it was said that because these statues are out in the open and the desert wind blowing them the statues suffer erosion but this was a strange kind of erosion it was an erosion that only affected the nose of the statue but as more inquiries went into the absence of these nose on these statues it was discovered that when the Grecians and other Caucasians visited Egypt, there was something troubling about these statues. They had nose that, that was characteristics of a black man. And it hurt their hearts to know that such gigantic historical work of art were produced by black people in the honor of black people. So what they did? They destroyed the noses of thousands of these statues because they were trying to hide the fact that these statues, these humongous statues were constructed by black men and black women in the honor of our people. People, our topic today, like father, like son, the apple don't fall too far from the tree. I've been telling you over and over and over, everything that you know, everything you think you know or thought you knew, is a lie. Everything is a lie. Because the children of Lucifer, the Edomites, the Caucasians, have spent their entire 
existence fabricating lies to distort reality because one they do not want the children of the Mosai to know that they are the Israelites of the Bible secondly they did not want anyone to know who they are and the main purpose was the Mosai said in his holy scripture that he will hate the Edomites and he will hate the Edomites forever and we know who the Edomites are the Edomites are the Caucasians the children of Lucifer so that is why Yahusha aka Jesus Christ was saying you are like your father your father is the father of lies he is the murderer there is no truth in him Please.